hello my people welcome again and thank you for clicking thank you for coming back to watch my video uh, on today's vlog first of all if you're coming across this face for the first time my name is Anne, an african kenyan woman based in germany and um, i'm based in the village and i normally share my lifestyle in the village okay as an african woman uh, as I promised you earlier on, I told you I will uh, uh, show you the progress of uh, my dad's uh, funeral. Of course, you are my online family. And uh, I promised to show you uh, the progress, okay, uh, the, everything until the burial. He was buried yesterday and everything was, was okay, despite the fact that I was not there. But I've been attending the meeting online. I've been attending the Zoom I even attended the uh I even attended the the burial it was uh, live streamed and then yes I attended everything so it was okay and I told you the reason I, I didn't go it's like um let me, I, you know I also don't like sharing some personal things like I am telling everything which is not even necessary for me to come and say if I find something not necessary, normally I, I prefer not to share, right? So the reason of me not going, it's not actually necessary for me to share, but I'll be going home in the course of the year. Some of the people have been reaching out. They have been asking if it's the the, the, the air ticket, of which is uh, uh, very true. You can ask such a question. But um, here especially where I work, they always give soft loan. If you need money, they can give it to you and then you return later. Or you can just ask, they pay you for the next month and then you work extra. But it's not about money. Uh, it's not about money because when it comes to my father-in-law's funeral, honestly speaking, my, the, my mother-in-law paid like everything because they had uh, planned already. They... I'll tell you something small about it, about the thing, my parents-in-law. They already plan for their funeral, okay? Even my mother-in-law now, she's not sick, she's not old, but she has already planned for, for she has set aside for the money of, um, of in case something like that happened, God forbid. And then also, they always set aside money for driving school for the children. Even Baba, they have already put the money aside for her for him that is their their that is how they plan things so i cannot say we use money on my father-in-law's uh, uh, funeral okay so it's not about money it's just some family issues and i don't find it necessary for me to share it here okay so let me share how the funeral was yeah just a little bit of it and then in the next video i will tell you the difference between German funeral and African funeral, okay? Okay, let's watch together. I'll just do the summary. <laughs> In this country, you must appreciate them. 
na mimi unajua I was also a sportsman sasa lazima nitambue hii watu I played rugby so naona kaa kwa office siku hizi je kitu nasema kwa yeye
Okay, I hope uh, you've been following uh, the program. I try to make it as short as possible um, because of time. I didn't want to go like the full program because it will take ages. And that was it. It was a summary of it. It ended well. And I thank God for my dad's life. He lived so well. Um, I bless him for that. So that was it. And we celebrate the dead. Yeah. Uh, we just appreciate God for the life that, that they have been living and uh, we let them go. Otherwise, thank you for watching.